Inner Sanctum Mystery, starring Peter Satriga.
I'll be trapped. There's nothing I can spin on you, but somehow I feel that you know more than you appear to know. You look into this more thoroughly later. Good night. Did you know 
notice anything? No, but there's plenty of places to hide. Wait a minute. There's something behind that ledge. Oh, I hear something. Come on out of here, shoot. Shoot at the first thing that moves from that ledge. But I 
I wouldn't shoot them. After all, they didn't mean to do it. All I know is that they shot a fellow. I'm worried about my other cat, Sheba. Have you seen her doll today? Yes, she was in the hall a little while ago. Oh, I tell you, you miss everything. This house is giving me a nervous breakdown. I haven't let Bobby go to school for two days. I'm afraid I don't know what to do. I have so much shopping to do, and I'm afraid to leave him alone. Tell me, would it be too much trouble, Mr. Hayden, if I asked you to stay with Bobby while I did some shopping? Well, of course, Mr. Jackson. I'd like to watch you going. Oh, thank you so much. The door. I just got my purse. There won't be more than 15 minutes. That's all right. No need to worry. We're having a special to do anyway. Oh, you can go now. It just walked in. Oh, here you are, my darling Sheba. Been hiding in the hall, haven't you? Now you be a good boy, Bobby. Don't you miss it? What is it, Mommy? So you're having a holiday, are you, Bobby? Yes, yes, Miss Hagen. Mommy wants me to stay home. What's that doing? Hanging the morning for us. Get the first dress up and see. Oh, that's very good. You know for him? Oh, oh, yeah, I know. Dickory, dickory, Doc. Let me hear it. Oh. Come on, don't be shy. Uh, I'll tell you what, if you recite a poem, I'll recite one off. You promise? Yes, I promise. Yes. Yeah. Dickory, dickory, Doc. The mouse ran out the clock. The clock took one, and down he ran. Dickory, dickory, Doc. Very good. Now, now you recite. All right. Pussycat, pussycat. Where have you been? I went to London. See the Queen. <laughs> Pussy cat, pussy cat, what did you do there? I frightened a little mouse and a little <laughs> Tell me more. All right, you know this one. Ding dong bell. Pussy's in the well. You see, you already reciting one about a cat. Now tell me one about a dog. Don't you like cats? Oh. Oh, I like dogs best. I wish I had a dog. Well, I do how many times better than cats. Be quiet, you little fool. What do you know about cats? Nothing at all. Are you mad at me, Mr. Hagen? I don't like little boys who don't know what they're talking about. Oh, here you put it. Here you put it. Here you put it. I don't know how to play them. Well, 
must admit, Hagen's murder motive was something unusual. Crash, it's a uh, cat. <laughs> now, uh, did any of you ever threw a shoe at someone's cat smelling in your backyard? I'd advise you to leave quietly now and, and uh, go home with a friend tonight. Hmm? Well, it's about time to close the door to the inner sanctum until this same time next Sunday evening. Now listen in, won't you, and invite your friends to also. Oh, uh, by the way, uh, you happen to know anyone who's looking for a pet? We have two cats roaming around here who need a good home. Their names? Eva and Empress. Well, here they are right now. I'll just put your name and address on a slip of paper and slip it under the squeaking door. Well, good night. Pleasant dream. by the National Broadcasting Company.